much has been spoken about exit of sunburn and the tweet by Mr. Harinder Singh, the promoter of sunburn as far as Goa is concerned, that this is going to be the last sunburn in Goa. I'm sure Mr. Harinder knows the biggest acquisition of sunburn by one of our biggest company in India. And for him, it was very critical that this sunburn is held in Goa. So when I said that, please don't shed crocodile tears, Mr. Harinda ji, I mean it. I know Goa government always offered you a red carpet and Goa has created the brand sunburn. You tried to take sunburn elsewhere, but you failed miserably. So you have a lot to give to Goa and thank Goa in that regard. But biggest takeaway for Goa from all this is utter chaos, corruption, loss of businesses, loss of small businesses. You always try to cash in on the crowd that rushes to Goa in the month of December. Instead of bringing good tourists to Goa, you decided to cash in on the tourists which are already coming to Goa. So you did not give any enhancement to tourism in Goa. You did not give the benefit that the festival should have afforded or accorded to Goa and Goans. But instead, you added to the chaos that we see in the months of December. You always cashed in on the crowd that comes to Goa during December. And you are aware that this is your last festival, as you say, and you want to try to make it emotional and make it look as if I am bidding adieu to Goa because of the fact that whatever that has happened in the past, but the fact remains as that you know that Sunburn is going to be acquired by one of our bigger companies and you have added to the valuation of the company by having the festival in Goa time and again. So again, I insist and I reiterate the fact that don't cry crocodile tears. There is nothing emotional for you. You have always cashed in and benefited out of Goa and never ever given something that benefits Goa. We have seen this in, during this time also that, that there, is a, there is a downfall in the number of tourists which came to Goa and you did not add any value to Goa as far as your festival is concerned. And you only took away those revelers or the, the festival people who came to celebrate their New Year's in Goa from the local businesses, from the local restaurants, from the rec local music places to yourself and you cashed in, added to your valuation, and now you're going to sell your business to, uh, to be acquired by another bigger company. So stop shedding crocodile tears. ABP Mazhar, Ugda Dole, Bagha Neat.